What's going on YouTube? Ray Woods here, channel Crab About The Bucket, and welcome to my channel. On this channel, I educate and give advice on my past mistakes so I can help you avoid them. If you're new to this channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification, so you know when I'm coming out with more quality content. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to find different networking events around your area. Now, you don't typically learn communication skills in school unless you're in a type of organization, you're doing Toastmasters outside of school or some other event that you have to do some speaking. And effective communication doesn't matter if you're an introvert or if you're an extrovert. Effective and honest communication is gonna build your relationships. Relationships is gonna increase your network and your network is your net worth. So let's go ahead and head to the computer. I'm gonna show you these different sites that can help you. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so we're gonna keep this video really simple here. Now, the first thing I wanna go after is uh, the different networking events. We're gonna be Eventbrite. So you'll literally go up to the browser, type in Eventbrite. And for example, I'm out in Atlanta and I can filter here. I'm in the mood for, let's see, you got family, education, all these different topics, sports, fitness. I'm gonna click business since we're talking about business you know, career, jobs, whatever that you're trying to go after, right? And I'm gonna come here and let's just say, let's say I do next month, let's put it out there, out a couple of days. So February, we got uh, Alliance annual meeting from day one, just a whole list of different things you can find within your area. Now I'm, I'm in Atlanta, of course you wanna type in your area, Business Builder Summit, Women in Business and Technology Career Fair, Atlanta Job Fair, uh, Atlanta networking, social mixer, you know, all these different things. And of course you got your filters over here. So if you want to filter out for price, free, paid, the format, what type it is, the category, the date, and see what times work best for you. It's just as simple as that. If we go to the next one, we're going to look at meetup. So meetup, similar thing. So they got a tons of different categories here you can find around your area. If we go to career and business, We're gonna do, you got Atlanta Startup Village, South Atlanta Ria, different real estate events, Atlanta Networking, Meet New People. Again, tons of different uh, things you can meet up to, to meet new people and get into the career you wanna do. And it's just unlimited stuff. And the last thing is just as simple as go up to Google. So we'll go up to Google and I'll type in networking events in Atlanta. And literally you can come here and search more events. So you got the whole uh, screen here. And you know, a, a lot of these events are probably similar to, you know, Meetup and to Eventbrite, but you can come out here and just see what different events you got, different times, different dates, and find those events. Spend you a little bit of money, try to go to one to two events per week if your schedule allows that. And, you know, go after what you wanna go after. Uh, you know, this is stuff that we, we did not learn in school. This is stuff that, you know, I never knew about, and I wish I would've knew about it, it would've put me at a, a, a little more advanced position. And I wanna show this to you guys because this is stuff you just don't learn on a day-to-day -day basis. This is stuff you gotta go out and search for yourself. Another thing too is they have an app called, and it's out here in Atlanta, it's called Pro Networker app, right? And this app, gives a bunch of different networking events that are not really always listed on these other different sites that you find online. And that app just happened to be from somebody that I met at a networking event. He creates apps, he created his own app because he does, he hosts events and he creates events. And I ended up, you know, getting a hold of that app where I have different network events nobody else may not have. It's kind of like an insider type of uh, networking thing. So when you meet people like that, you may bump into somebody like that that has an app like that for your side. So this is why I say you go out there, you network, you go put your face out there, put your name out there, and you both make some things happen. Now I wanna to touch on a few key points on how you should be networking after you find these things on the internet and these different networking events. So the number one thing is make sure you go there with the mindset of helping other people. You don't wanna go there and be greedy, Nobody's going to want to work with you. Nobody's going to want to help you out. Go there with the idea of how can I help these people out with what they're doing, and then you're going to get that back. As you're talking to people, you're going to meet a bunch of different random people. 
And you don't just want to flood up to them and be like, hey, here's my business card. Take this. Let me throw it in their face. You don't, <laughs> don't want to do that. Go up to them, greet them. Hey, how you doing? What's your name? Okay, nice to meet you. What is it that you do? What's your career? What field of, what field of expertise are you in? That's how you will want to greet people. Number three, business cards. Make sure you have some business cards. Yes, yeah, some people say business cards may be outdated and they even may have an e-card on their phone or something. But even if you don't own a business, you're not all the way in your career yet, have the card with your contact information. Put your name, your number, your email, your LinkedIn profile. You can make a QR code and put it on the card. It makes you just are able to give them something that they can keep in contact with you if you don't necessarily get their number on your phone right off the bat or add them on LinkedIn. Number four, don't be awkward. Don't be going and talking to people like, uh, what should I say? What, what should I do? Don't, don't, don't sit in the corner. You know how them people be in a club, they be posted up in the corner. I know everybody went to the club, so don't lie. They be in the corner posted up, just looking around, not saying anything, drinking a drink. No, go out there and you, this is your time to get out of your comfort zone and put yourself in a position that you want to go after. So don't be awkward. Just go out there and be yourself and talk to people. Number five, don't ever say, I can't help you with that. There's a few, there, there's, there's some people that really say this. They really go up in there and they say, and I've heard it in different network events. They say, well, I don't know if I can help you with that. No, you don't say stuff like that. You're five people away from knowing everybody. You, you can meet somebody that knows somebody that knows somebody that can help the person that you talked to originally. If somebody asks you that they're looking to uh, build their social media or build their, or uh, get into this type of career, they're into finance or accounting, be like, you know what? I don't have the information, but I do have a contact that I can get you in touch with that could possibly help you with that situation. Let me reach out to them. Let me get your contact information. Let me reach out to them and then they can reach out to you so they can help you out. And the last one on how to networking is Talk about your needs after they're done talking. Most of the time, whenever you're having a conversation with somebody at these network events, you're gonna greet each other. You're gonna get each other name. And then you're gonna ask what they're doing as far as their career or their business, unless they're more direct and they're asking you first. If, they, if you ask them that question first, they're gonna get into the spill of what they're doing. And I like to pull out a question like, you know, what is it is that uh, you're looking to grow or you're looking to change or you're looking to improve? Is it something that I can help you with? Once they're done with that, they're going to come back at you and ask you, what is it that you do? You know, it's enough talking about me. What is it that you do? Then that's where you come out. You tell them I'm in this career. I'm in this business. I'm looking for this. I'm looking for that. Blah, blah, blah. So don't come at them first. You, you want to you wanna make sure that they're coming at you when they're asking, what is it that you do? And, and asking, how is it that they can help you out? I hope I was able to give you some valuable information. As you can see on a computer, it's so many different things you can find when it comes to these network events. So you can get in front of the right people to land in the job that you want, the career that you want, build your network, whatever it is that you may be going after. So if this video helped you, go ahead and hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel, hit that bell notification, and you will be notified whenever I come out with more quality content like this. And until next video, I'll see you guys around.